Hey Ali, how are you? Hey, what's up? Wait a minute, aren't you Walid from Vidu Films? Yes, I am. Hey, do you mind if I share something with you? Yeah, sure. Well, I've been reading the Quran lately and I thought I'd share some quotes that I found interesting. All right. O oh, you who believe, let not some amongst you mock others. It may be that the latter are better than the former. Very nice. Speak straight true words. Great. And this one says, And kill them wherever you find them, and turn them out from where they've turned you out from. Yeah, that's cool. Alright, but... Wait, what? You support mass murder? No... Who said anything about mass murder? This verse says, kill them wherever you find them. Yeah, and? So it means kill all disbelievers? Yeah, no. The verse is talking about a specific group of disbelievers who were fighting, killing, and exiling the Muslims from their homes. And the verse was commanding the Muslims to fight back and defend themselves. But the verse doesn't say a specific group. Nor does the verse say that the disbelievers were fighting the Muslims. So it must mean all disbelievers. But it does. You just need to read the surrounding verses to understand the context. <laughs> Nonsense. If what you said was true, then the context would be made apparent in the verse itself. I shouldn't have to look around the verse in order to understand the context of this verse. I mean, what do you call such an irrational standard of comprehension? Reading? Pfft. Come on, mate. That's just an excuse. It's not my fault that your Quran isn't clear. You know what? You're absolutely correct. I've been lying to myself this entire time, probably suffering from cognitive dissonance or something. I really need to stop making excuses. Exactly. So now that we agree with each other, I've been reading your Twitter feed lately, and I found some quotes here that are quite interesting, and I'd like to share them with you. All right, all right, well, here you say, but it's out of context said every theist in the face of criticism. Yes, that's how every theist responds to criticism. And here you respond to another tweet saying something very similar. Precisely my point. Ask and the nice fluffy verses are authentic and real, and the nasty stuff is mistranslated or out of context. How convenient. That's right. Theists love to make excuses for all the bad stuff in their religion. Then why are you Muslim? What? I'm not a Muslim. Well, that's confusing, because in this tweet you said the following. But brother, the Qur'an said it's true. Therefore, it must be true. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. I was being sarcastic. I don't actually believe the Qur'an is true. But this tweet doesn't say you were being sarcastic. It doesn't have to say I was being sarcastic. If I had to explain every time I was being sarcastic, then it would ruin the point of sarcasm. But how do I know you're being sarcastic and not contradicting yourself if the tweet didn't say you were being sarcastic? All right, look, mate, just trust me, okay? I was being sarcastic. All right, well, what about these? In this tweet, you tell people not to build snowmen. And in another tweet, you claim that Valentine's Day is a haram pagan festival. So you really believe people shouldn't build snowmen and that Valentine's Day is a haram pagan festival? No, mate, those videos are satire. But the tweets don't say it's satire. Look, bruv, if you just look at my Twitter profile and all the other tweets surrounding these tweets, including the videos themselves, you'll see very clearly that these videos are satire. But I shouldn't have to do that. I mean, it seems clear to me that you literally believe that people shouldn't build snowmen and that Valentine's Day is a pagan haram festival. Now you're contradicting yourself? No, bruv, I'm not contradicting myself. Look, I'm telling you, the videos are satire. Wait, 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 wait. You think all videos are satire? That's pretty ridiculous, man. What? I never said all videos are satire. Uh, yes you did. You said the videos are satire. The videos obviously means all videos. I meant those videos. The ones we were just talking about. Then why didn't you just say those videos? I mean, why are you being so unclear? Look, bruv, the doesn't always mean all. We're obviously talking about my videos. So now all of your videos are satire? No! Not all of my videos are satire! Just the ones we were just discussing! So then why didn't you just say the videos we were just discussing? Because it's obvious! Alright, alright, then how do you explain this tweet? The individual is divine. Let's keep it that way. What, so you really believe humans are gods? 
I thought you didn't believe in fairy tales. No, it's hyperbole. <laughs> okay then, what about this one? No to identity politics in any shape or form. Wait, so you honestly believe that politics comes in shapes like triangles and squares and circles and octagons and... I mean, that's pretty absurd. No! That's not how I was using those words. It's a completely different diction and syntax. <laughs> oh, come on. Really? Then what about this? Be a real and genuine individual without having to borrow credit or guilt from your race, gender, or religion. Oh, so you're saying that only people who borrow credit cards from their race, gender, or religion are real people? Huh? Other people aren't actually real? They don't deserve human rights like everyone else? No! I was not using the words real and genuine literally. I was using them figuratively. And, and credit cards? I mean, what are you talking about? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, and I'm sure you were speaking figuratively when you said the following. Stand on your own two feet and show the world what you are capable of. Now don't try to wiggle your way out of this one, Walid. It's very obvious that you have something against paraplegics. You disgust me, you... you cis bipedal bigot. Brav, you're killing me. Hey, are you okay? Do you... do you need to go to the hospital? I, I can get the car, I mean... Look, bruv, that's enough! Alright? When people communicate, they don't need to spell everything out for you in every statement and in every word, alright? Speech and writing have to be understood holistically. I mean, you can read the tone and, and, and how words are being used and, and, and what those words are referencing. I mean, this is just basic principles of language, mate. It's like common sense. I, I really don't understand why this is so difficult for you. I mean, why you keep taking me out of context, mate? Mental gymnastics. I never thought I'd see the day, Walid. I never thought I'd see the day.